Woo, smoky. What's up, everybody? Hope everybody's having a great night. I'm um, having a great night. It's another Ashton ESG 21 year salute night. I'm running low on these puppies. I had a box of Churchill's, Torpedoes, the Lonsdales, I think they were the Lonsdales, and the Robustos. I've got one Churchill, one Torpedo, and like 10 Robustos left. Excellent cigars. Hello. Very much worth the price. A little pricey, but I mean, you pay for quality, and these are pretty damn good. But, anyways, hope you're all having a great night. Another night. This is like night 113th at the hotel. Ha <laughs> uh, ha. What can I say? Regardless of whatever, still blessed. Life is good. Living life, loving life. But, anyways, I want to get with you guys about the cigar pass. I'm waiting on a few more names, with we'll watch a few addresses, and then once I get those, I'm going to finalize the order, and it's going to be in a certain order, so that way everybody in the States are going, then it's going up north, and, you know, to my brothers in Canada, you know, and then right back down and stuff, so it's going to be, a, you know, a set order. Now, the rules to it is, no one's going to know the order, except the first person to get it. Only the people that receive it are going to know who, who goes next. So let's say... I'm going to send it to Nick. So Nick will receive my package. He'll have my cigars in there. And only he will know the, next, the order of the next person that he's going to send. you got to keep that surprise and stuff, you know. No switching back and forth and stuff like that, the addresses and stuff. And, you know, that's just what makes it fun, that excitement, because you never know. You know, it might be you. It might not be. It might be you today. It might be you next week. And stuff, that's just the thrill of it. Now, the rules for the cigars, I figure I make a video and explain it a little better as opposed to trying to type it out and it all gets lost in translation but it's simple absolutely you know as far as for trade you know for the cigar pass absolutely no second hand no cigars that are uh, mixed fillers or uh, combo fillers you know anything like that it's got to be straight falling into the premium category premium premium you know premium can mean a lot of things but you know Ashton's, uh, uh, DE's, anything like that. Now, as far as infused cigars and things, we stay away from infused cigars. Obviously, you know, co-mingle, mix and mingles and all that stuff with the, with the cigars. But if you want to do that, this is how it works. Let's say Nick sends me five Ashton's, you know, ESG's. I'm going to take them, and it's my choice whether I take them all and replace them. So if I replace them, I'm going to replace them, you know, with something... And again, it doesn't have to be of equal value because not everybody's going to be able to send a forty, fifty, a hundred dollar cigar. You know, there are some premium cigars out there for five, six, seven bucks and stuff. And this is just the, you know, for the fun of it. And again, you know, you getting, you know, some of these and stuff, that's a treat. You know, the next person, you know, ought to expect you or that person expects to get something of that value because then again, you know, we're doing this. This is out of our own, you know, our stash, our secret stash. So I know a lot of us got some good stuff out there. And I'm rambling on. And um, but anyways, I can choose to take all five cigars and replace them, or I could take one cigar and replace it. And also another thing that we can do is if we choose to take all five or just one and replace it, we can actually add extra for the next person. Now here's another thing: if you wanted to send seconds or mixed fellows and things like that, you can, but only after you replace, you know, the, your premium cigars with it. Because, again, it'll be a treat for the next guy. Capiche? Now, if you wanted to send something like uh, infused cigars, uh, obviously you want to send that in a separate bag and things like that. Uh, you know, because there's going to be a tupador, you know, going around, you know, with a humidity bag and all that stuff in there. So, again, if you want to send infused cigars, that's something separate. Don't include it with the cigars because, again, I don't want my ass and tasting like fucking mint or chocolate. You know, pay $40 for a fucking mint and chocolate. I'll go to the divers and get a bag for, you know, three bucks, you know, or something like that. So, but anyways, again, the rules for this is, is very simple. And once this goes through and stuff like that, you know, the 10 guys that are doing it will expand it. You know, hopefully, you know, the following month and stuff will expand it. <clears throat> you know, make it even bigger. Get 15, 20 guys because that's the whole fun of it. The more people you get, you know, it's just that anticipation of getting some wicked fucking cigars. And let me tell you, 
you know, there, there's chances some of you guys are going to get some cigars you've never even heard of, never ever had, or like, holy shit, that's the cigar I've wanted and stuff. So stay tuned. Hopefully once, you know, within the next couple of days, come Monday or Tuesday, we're going to be kicking this bad boy off and stuff. So long ashes to you. Stay smoky. Peace. <laughs> this action is for you, baby. <laughs> Peace out, people.